Hannah, having you in my life is an answer to prayer. I asked God for it, but I knew I didn't deserve it. I begged him to forgive me for not being there for you. One of the greatest blessings in my life has been getting to know my daughter. I praise God for you, Hannah. You don't know how proud I am of you. I wake up every morning with a smile on my face, ready to pray for you. I've been praying that you would know that I love you and that God loves you. He says, I know the plans that I have for you, plans to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to give you a hope and a future. I've been praying for your grandmother too, that he would help her and draw her to himself. Hannah, the second mile is behind you. One more to go. Find your breathing rhythm, because we have one more hill coming up. This is where you'll pass another girl. Remember, attack this hill. If someone is in front of you, fight past her. <laughs> you can shake her hand after the race. Big breath, Hannah. Now take the hill. We have another update. With half a mile to go, it's Jim Mims in first, Anna Grant in second, and Joy Taylor in third. Hannah, if you're like me, this is where your body hits the wall. But we're going to push through it. This is where you think like a winner. Most runners will slow down, but not you. You have half a mile to go, and it belongs to you. If your legs are burning, let them burn. Your lungs may be tired, but they're not done yet. Other runners are feeling the same thing. You've got to get yourself in position. Your last kick is coming. If anyone is in front of you, you've got to get around them. Don't let anyone block you.